Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials up 70 points, NASDAQ up 38, S&P's up 9.5, gold contract up $1.90, trading at 1496 an ounce. We got silver up 13 cents, $17.56 an ounce. Light sweet crude up 64 cents, $54 flat. Notes and bonds. You get the 10 year down two ticks, 129.29, 30 year off one at 160.08, and King Dollar. King Dollar down 390 ticks, trading 97,612. Let's get over and take a look at the bonds first. Because we have with the bonds out here, folks, notes as well as bonds. They're rejecting lower price out here. They do have lighter volume. Got down to a price point today of 129.16. Inside the 10-year, right now you're at 129.29. And bottom line is that as long as you close inside 129.23, that's going to be a rejection of lower price with much lighter volume. That's going to say, once again, that notes and bonds want higher price. We're going into uh, 2 million contracts, and you've only done 1.3. We're going to take a look at the 30-year note, 30-year bond, rather, 30-year bond, uh, exact same setup. 30-year bond got down to 159.10, got under the lows of last week, which is the 160.02. You're above it right now. You've done 218,000 contracts. When we take a look at the uh, last week, what we were dealing with there, you're dealing with uh, 487,000, so big numbers, meaning you rejected lower price with tremendously lighter volume. Gold contract, gold contract up at buck seventy, trading two hundred and ninety-one dollars. We go take a look at silver out here. Silver right now, December contract, trading up thirteen cents, seventeen dollars fifty-three cents. Uh, we got a little juice uh, inside the silver market, fifty-nine thousand con uh, contracts. King dollar, king dollar is trading lower with conviction. We have out here, you're down almost four hundred ticks. Uh, you're in the lower range right now. As soon as we got back inside. A 98.371 got you in the lower range. Uh, right now, we're 600 ticks underneath that. We're at 97.608. That's saying that coming at us is going to be the lowest swing point of this consolidation. We've been in 95.843. We'll see if you can get any more traction than that. The S&Ps, the Dow Industrials, NASDAQ, bottom line, you get a sideways movement up here more than anything. Uh, what's going to be intriguing is to see you do have another huge contraction of volume inside the SPY, and we'll see uh, if the SPY, in fact, is going to do uh, lighter volume than yesterday, which would be pretty amazing. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.